Taboo Tech, the brainchild of these four top-level touring pros, is an industry leader in lore design and innovation. And now, Team Taboo has put its stamp of approval on a newly developed lure that will change the way bass anglers approach jig fishing. Introducing the Taboo Open Water Series Jig. The OW Series Jig combines decades of professional bass fishing knowledge into a new design that allows anglers to now fish both deep and shallow structure effectively with the same jig. For FLW Pro and Team Taboo member Dave Lefebvre, the Taboo Open Water Series combines all the methods the pros use to customize their jigs into one package. The Taboo OW Series is set to change the way you fish a jig forever. Hi, I'm Dave Lefebvre, and this is what I make my living with right here, the Taboo Open Water Series jig. That's a nice one right there. You know, I use it for a lot of different things, I'll be honest. But when it comes to fishing for schools, suspended bass, fish on points, deep brush piles, making them super long casts, you can't beat this baby right here. And this is where I get excited about a taboo jig. I'm gonna throw it upwind. I'd say probably about 25, 30 yards. So with this bait, I can make that really long cast and just leave it sink. You know, I let it sink probably almost to the bottom a lot of times and just start swimming it back in. It's like you'd swim a crankbait or a spinnerbait, and there's one there. Look at that. See, I don't even really have to really jerk really hard with it, you know, just a little bend in the rod's all you need. That actually feels like a really nice one. Look at that one. right there that's what it's all about you know that was awesome you know just throw it out there let it sink I just started swimming at what I swam at about 10 feet or so and he just loaded up on it didn't set the hook just eased into him good fish you know in developing this jig we really nitpicked it you know we it, everything from the from the fiber guard size to the the size of the skirt and and everything you know and and one of the great things about it is the weed guard angle sounds simple but a lot of jigs that you buy, the weed guard's up here, and that can cause, you know, can cause you problems. Sometimes a fish will bite it, and you know, you got this going on. You want that at an angle. There's no jig on the market that has more of an angle than this one. Um, again, this is right out of the package. I didn't even trim it, haven't even put it in the water yet. Skirt is tied on. Real, real important when you're fishing out in deep water. A lot of times you'll fish in uh, a school of fish, say, and they'll bite it two or three times before they get it. And you don't want those fish uh, pulling the skirt down, or you don't want to, you know, on a hook set, pull your skirt down, and then that ruins your opportunity for another bite and catching that fish. So that's real, real important. Some of the other features of this jig, it's got a planing head, um, as you can see, it just makes it go true through the water, it doesn't go side to side, and the matte finish. It's a, just a little bit different look, something that we all felt was important. I was swimming that jig back, and he hit that one by the boat. Look at that one. Hey. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Look at the size of that thing. That's a nice one right there. Taboo jig. Like I said, this jig can't be beat out in open water. But I use it a lot for other applications, like fishing docks. A lot of times when you're skipping around cables and ropes and under pontoon boats, you're not always in the best position to set the hook. <laughs> that was awesome. He was way up in that, underneath that pontoon boat. Just skip that jig way back up there, slide it right up under there. He was on the bank, up under the boat. Awesome. And with this bait, I don't have to get a good hook set. I know if he bites it and I get a little bit of bend in my rod, he's coming in the boat. There's one hit it. A lot of times, yeah, he got it again. A lot of times, like I was going to say, they'll hit it two or three times before you actually get a hook in them. And that's actually the advantage of the, the skirt being tied. You know, one of the things that I really like about this, and it's so important, especially when fishing open water, a lot of times those fish will bite, and most times, three or four times before you actually get a hook up. You know, it'll be donk, 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 and then it'll load up. And sometimes those fish, especially spotted bass and smallmouth, They'll grip that thing so hard that they'll pull the skirt down, 
pull the trailer down, whatever. Um, and it's very important to have a tied skirt. So that's what we did with this open water jig. Tied on there, there's no way that's ever going to fall down. And a lot of times that'll help you catch more fish. Just come right to me. <laughs> it's time to change the way you fish a jig with the Taboo Open Water Series. That's the Taboo Open Water Series jig. I'm Dave LaFibra and I approve this bait.